Welcome to this video. Over the next few minutes, we will show you what's new in Sage 300 version 2022, Product Update 1. Sage 300 2022 Product Update 1 offers users exciting features that guarantee increased flexibility and capability needed for today's business. This latest version presents additional functionalities and superior user experience through web screens improvements and desktop screens improvements. First, let's have a look at web screens improvements. If you use Sage 300 Project and Job Costing to manage contracts, you can now use the web screens to work with job-related documents in Accounts Payable. The Accounts Payable Invoice Entry screen includes a job-related option. When this option is chosen, new columns appear in the grid and you can now enter the contract, project, category, billing type, billing rate, resource, and other information as necessary. If you are entering a prepayment for the invoice, after you click prepay, there is also a job related option for the prepayment. If the option is selected, the jobs button becomes available. Clicking Jobs opens a screen where you can enter the job-related information for the prepayment. For an invoice, the Accounts Payable Batch Listing Report now includes a Show Job Details option. Similarly, the Accounts Payable Posting Journals Report for an invoice also gives you the option to include job details in the report. The new printing process for web screens that was released with the Sage 300 2021 version is now extended to custom crystal reports. You will now have improved overall performance while printing custom reports. When printing a report, a preview of the report will no longer be displayed in the crystal reports viewer. Instead, the export report screen appears in a new browser tab and provides options for saving the report to a file. To print a physical copy of the report, you can save it to a PDF and then print to your printer from the PDF. The web screen sign-on page has significantly improved to be more consistent with the other Sage solutions. Some of these changes include the sign-on button being disabled while the company details get loaded, a spinner indicating that a network is slow, and improve messaging for errors and password changes. New navigation buttons have been added on key fields that can be used to move to the first, previous, next, and last records. These new record controls allow you to move forward and backward one record at a time or through several records similar to the desktop UI. Users can now quickly enter data in the grid using shortcut keys on the PJC Transactions web screens. More information on web screens can be found on the Sage 300 Cloud web screens online help page or in the Sage 300 Cloud web screens getting started guide. Let's now review the desktop screens improvement. With this version, there is now Finder support for 64-bit financial reporter. For more information about this release, including technical information, program fixes, requirements, and more, please refer to the Sage 300 2022 Product Update 1 release notes. Congratulations! You now know what's new in Sage 300 version 2022 Product Update 1.